Alright, what is up you guys? And of course always welcome back to another OU battle versus Albi in what I can only hope is a game without that your Shifu. That would be nice. So I, I wanna wrap it up with that. Um oh, this is cool. This is actually really cool. Um It's not like first class I felt this could be um Sun Team, but no, it's just Torkoal. Would probably like heavy, heavy duty for everybody to kind of work their way through. Um, not particularly fond of Sarud actually against my team. Um, I think Cinderace could be rather annoying. But overall, I feel Torkoal is probably my worst opposing Pokemon. And um, I think that's also going to be his lead. Even though I think like he piled on and stuff scares it off. But. Um, my easiest lead is actually start off with Roll Charm and just go for a Volt Switch and take it from there. The way I see it, he has two really strong leads in both uh, Cinderace and potentially Dragapult. So we'll see what happens. Hmm, Sarud. Cool. Um, now, with Sarud, we know it's always physical, but we also know that it's probably always scarfed because everything else just doesn't work for it um, so I'm actually gonna send in uh, Hippowdon because the way I see it um, he should U-turn or go for a dark move let's see Dorgus Lariat. So that was eventful. Now, like I said, I'm probably convinced he is um, Choice Scarf. I'm actually going for a Toxic here. Let's see. Oh, or you can Dynamax. That's nice. Um, <laughs> oh, that was a, ah, really? Dude, way too early, way too early. So we lose power on here, that's pleasant. Would be nice if we can take this hit, but we shouldn't. Okay. Okay. So, uh, we're gonna have a few turns of absolute devastation in Stalin. So. I go for that Max Knuckle and Dynamax myself. I will absolutely speed here. So hopefully I win this matchup. And just get as much damage in there as possible and then try to uh, try to reconsider how to beat this. Because this did not go as planned. Of course it didn't. Um, I mean, double the power from Max Overgrowth will be annoying, but... Uh, I think we still should do good damage. Alright, next one will absolutely knock him out. Wrong move, buddy. Wrong move. Should have maxed overgrowth. Should have doubled the power with that. The rookie mistake. I hate to see it. So the question is, do you sack your Sarud or do you switch in Dragapult? This is kind of a rough position for him, isn't it? Because it brings in Dragapult, then um, yeah, he just decide to draw. Then I can just go for Max Darkness and follow that up. Yeah.
So I think we get Dragapult here. And I should not sack my Stalton just yet. Right, decides to withdraw, makes sense. Two Torkoal, try to stomach the hit from Max Darkness, it makes sense. And I'm not necessarily all that worried. Been unsure what Max Darkness does, like a secondary effect. Special defense drops, yeah, that's not helping right now. But Torkoal has... How annoying can you be? You have Stealth Rocks, you have... Uh, Lava of Loom, which could actually hurt. Versus my team, it actually does quite a lot. Let's see. I hope it goes for um, Stealth Rocks, actually. Earth Power would be nice, also. Stealth Rocks, that's actually quite right. So a free Stone Edge going my way. Or he crash. Let's see. I mean, none of his mon enjoyed his Stone Edge, so really hope I connect it. That's kind of what I need. The size would draw. Goes to Sarud. Potentially sacking it, I guess? If I had connected it. Still though, you're physical, so hopefully we should be able to stomach any hit you can throw at me. Power Whip. Would be nice if you missed. We did take it though, which is like the best part about it. So we get him out of the way. Should not have been able to take that much damage onto us. Ah, <sighs> that stinks. It really does. Yeah, Dragapult makes sense. Um, what do we even have for Dragapult? Nothing really. I mean, just pressure it, but... Uh, it's not... Pre ah, I don't like this. I kind of want to save it. Right, singing scales. The way I see it, he should shadow ball here. Yeah. And we took that like a champ. So we tail went up. And um, I wonder whether or not this is specs, but nah. I just I, when you don't see life orb, you kind of start thinking maybe a bit too hard. Um, Singing Gabron, I think, just get that Stone Edge out of the way. Just throw as much Stone Edge out there as possible before it ends. Or Dragable might actually stomach it, now that I think about it. If I don't miss it, that is. You know, I'm, I am all kinds of fonts right now. I just want Dragable somehow out of the way. Because as long as it's kicking, I struggle a whole lot. Having a power on here would have been nice. Just saying. He's leveling back and forth. Right, he decides to not sag it at least. Goes to Togekiss. And nice. That Togekiss out of the way. Finally Stone Yor is doing something. That's rare. <laughs> Oh, 
All we needed was a bit of love. Or in Stone Jorah's case, not necessarily love, but something to work for it. Um, now he has Manibus, Torkoal, and Dragonfold. So I think my opponent somehow could pressure for a win here. Um, he has also Cinderace, so I just... Like, I'll take anything I get here. And then take my loss with pride. Come on, Stone... <laughs> Stone Edge! <laughs> we still have one more hit in us. I mean, even if I get ruined by Dragon Ball at this point, I'm just happy I'd actually... It actually worked. <laughs> Consider how the start was and all. Um, keep Stone Edge and hopefully we connect this one too. <laughs> we might as well rock polish right now, but that it wouldn't have helped. And I mean, I mean, still need a choice band damage. Oh, stone hedge, stone hedge, stone hedge. Oh, Gabrant, I'm gonna call you Gabrant. He's the man. Never seen anything like it. Okay. Did not expect that. Two Dragapult. Please connect this. Oh my god. <laughs> oh. The slaughter. The slaughter! <laughs> Shit! Shit! I never seen anything like this! I mean, Gabron falls here, for sure. And, um. I wonder what my opponent is thinking. Like, I, I still believe, like, Cinderace beats me too. Because at this point, I need to kind of break it. See, Senhebat, Libero, of course. Um, because he should be carrying high jump kick. So the way I see it, like that combination is alright, is so much for me to beat. So, uh, I'm gonna send in Stoutland and hope for the best. I hope somehow he's scarfed and is has all the wrong moves for this battle, but um, if he has high jump kick, then I believe it's a wrap. Powerball. Right, that might actually be enough also. Oh, please survive this. Come on, Wolf! It's not pleasant. It's not pleasant to lose like this. That's the thing. That's the thing. With the sun up and all, it just hurts. At least we know he's not locked in. But Powerball is just ruining me right now. So, to my opponent, like, yeah, it's a loss, but fuck it. If I didn't fight back. <laughs> Plus, he's not. He's fire type now, so it's gonna hurt. Nice. You could always wish for a powerball miss. Maybe. Let's see, it's a draw over. It's not over. Yeah, my opponent wins. Ah, uh, it sucks. But at the same time, I think my opponent did the right series of plays, actually. It probably wasn't all that easy to make those calls that he made. So, at least this freaking Cinderace, I'm glad I banned it. Never thought I'd say it, but uh, it ruined me here. So it, it made it one hell of a comeback, but I would be lying if um, the reason he wins this is because he Dynamaxed, uh, because Hippowdon should not have gone down in that battle. So to LB, GG, but Jesus Christ, if you want to Dynamax, fucking tell me, man, because there was no way I was going to let my Powdown go 
as long as your Cinderace and Drywall was still kicking. Mainly because not only did they shake them, but didn't struggle versus them. And I think you're aware of that toward a Torkoal and uh, Cinderace would not be able to challenge it. He pound whatsoever. But with that said, probably would have gotten this great showcase from Stone Edge or Stone Edge. So it's a silver lining, but um, yeah, I don't enjoy them. <laughs> I don't enjoy Dynamax when you have it made up beforehand. Let's just go into Dynamax. I think it's, I think it's quite cheap. Uh, so with that, you guys, as always, thank you for watching and um, have a great day, everyone.